Now that we are logged into our apps accounts and we have access Google Maps as the site that we want to use, we want to get started creating our own content on this site. You're going to notice two tabs here that are available in Google Maps. One is to get directions. Typically would you, you would use this if you wanted to get driving directions to a particular location. For our projects, we're going to be using My Maps. And if I click on this tab, you're going to see there's some instructions here on how to create Google Maps. So if you want to dig further than what I'm showing you, you can go ahead and watch that video. I'm going to go ahead and click Get Started. And you're going to notice now it gives me the option to name the map that I'm going to create. I'm going to call this Sample Map. And the description of this is going to be how to create your own maps. I get two options here. I have a public option, which means anyone in the world can see it. And I have an unlisted option, meaning I can share this with only those people who I want to see it. I'm going to choose public because I want this to be accessed by my teachers and classmates and parents and hit save. Once the document is saved, I'm now ready to begin creating content on the map on the right side.